How's it going everyone, Hero Gaming, and today we're playing Bloons Tower Defense 6. In this episode, I'm going to show you how to beat Haunted on half cash with no monkey knowledge and using soda, so let's jump right into it. Now, the first thing you want to do is drop a dart monkey right over here. You're going to get quick shots and get started. And then round 5, you want to make sure you turn off auto start. And then by the end of round 5, you want to drop another dart monkey right here. Get started and keep going. Now, by round 8, you want to make sure you have auto start turned off as well. There we go, and what you're going to want to do is make sure you have at least 271 cash. I have 274, so we should be good to go. We're going to sell both dart monkeys. We're going to drop Soda right over here. There we go, and speed things up. Turn on auto start, and we should be good to go. And then by round 12, well, we're not there yet, but what you're going to do on round 12 is you're going to, as soon as you get near 370, you want to slow this down. So I'll show you what that looks like. There we go, slow it down. And then we want to buy ourselves a sniper monkey right there. We're going to drop it right here. We're going to set it to strong and keep going. And then we want a wizard monkey right over here. And then fireball. And then we want wall of fire. At this point, we want to go back to the super monkey, get full metal jacket. And then fast firing. And then even faster firing. And then we want large caliber. And then we want to go back to our wizard monkey, get intense magic and monkey sense. And then we want a sniper monkey right here, a second one. We're going to go night vision goggles, fast firing, even faster firing. And now we're in round 40. What you're going to do is, is wait for the Moab to pop. As soon as it does, you set his ability and you should be good to go. And then we're going to get shrapnel shot. And then we want to go back to our wizard monkey, get dragon's breath. And then with the sniper monkey on the left, we want semi-automatic. And then round 52, this Moab right here. As soon as it pops, you sow his ability. You're good to go. Then you're going to go to your sniper, get full auto rifle. And this is only to the one on the left. And then we're going to drop another wizard monkey right here. We're going to go fireball. Wall of fire. Intense magic. Monkey sense. And then we want dragon's breath. And then you want Deadly Precision for the Sniper Monkey on the right. And then round 65. At the very end of it, you want to use Soda's level 10 ability. And that'll be right here. Soda's level 10 ability. We'll clean it up. And then you want to unlock Summon Phoenix. Doesn't really matter which monkey you do it on. The Wizard Monkey. And then round 1. When you get to this point, you want to use Summon Phoenix. And that's when the Moabs intersect right here. And then round 73, you are going to get a Fortified the Moab come in here. As soon as that happens, you Summon Phoenix, and you'll be good to go. And then you want to unlock Summon Phoenix on the second Wizard Monkey. So round 75, as soon as this Fortified Moab gets here, you want to use Summon Phoenix once. And then as soon as this Summon Phoenix runs out, you want to use Summon Phoenix again. There we go, another Summon Phoenix, and that'll take care of it. And then round 77, at this point, you want to use Summon Phoenix... And then round 78, on the first rush, you're going to use Soda's level 10 ability. And then you're going to wait, and it's going to spawn on the second rush as well. And then we're going to go back to our Sniper Monkey, get May Moab. And we're just waiting for the second rush to use... There we go. Soda's level 10 ability is recharged, so we're just going to wait for the second rush. And there it is. Clear it like that. And then we're going to drop a Ninja Monkey right here. We're going to go Ninja Discipline, Sharp Shurikens, Double Shot, Seeking Shuriken... And we're going to use Soda's level 10 ability right there on round 79. As soon as the balloons start intersecting. And then you want one summon Phoenix when you get these two fortified BFBs to show up. And if you've gotten to this point in the video, please consider subscribing. I upload at least twice every single day. And let's just watch this playthrough. So finally, with your Ninja Monkey, you will not be able to afford Balloon Jitsu. So just get Caltrops. And now what you're going to want to do here is very, very straightforward. You're just going to wait for the ZOMG to pop. And as soon as it does, you get all these BFBs. You're going to want to use Summon Phoenix once. And then you're going to want to use it again. And that's how it's done. I hope you guys enjoyed the video. Have a good one, guys. Bye now.